I wrote 21 subjects. I got 19 grade ones and two grade twos. I was a bit skeptical about some of the exams since they were difficult, but overall I'm proud of myself, of my achievement. It's all about time management. I had to prioritize things. Um, I had lessons and schools, so I had to schedule to up to a certain time because I live at Supernam. I had a certain hour I had to go home. It was difficult to get transportation at that time, but it was okay. That was Chevelle Solomon, a student of the Anna Regina Multilateral School on the Essequibo Coast and one of this year's CSEC Talk performers, talking to the newsroom recently. Like many of her peers pursuing numerous subjects, in her case 21 subjects, a lot of focus and dedication was required. Additionally, extra after-school lessons were needed and that meant that she had to go home late in the night. But Solomon had a bit more to consider. She lived at Supanam, quite on the opposite end of the Essequibo coast, and she had a lengthy journey to and from school and lessons every day. Despite these extra challenges, her mother Dorinda Roberts said that the family was keen on providing whatever support was necessary. I gave her the choice to decide how much subject she wanted to write. Um, she chose 18 subjects. And then afterwards, um, I got a call from Sir HM from Malti, and when we came in, he's, um, he was asking me to talk to her so she can write some more subjects. I spoke to her, she heard what HM had to say, and then she decided on her own what other subjects she wanted to write. So that rounded to the 21 subjects. Afterwards, I asked her, are you sure you want to write some more subjects? She said, no, I'm comfortable with that. I said, okay, I don't want to give you more than what you can handle. With this outstanding achievement, the young woman now looks forward to a career in medicine. I, ha I have an interest in um, science subjects, business subjects, and Spanish foreign language. I think I did it because I was comfortable with it and to get a proper job at the end of the day. S researching in like the medical field, um, as time progresses, I'll get a definite career that I want, but certainly in the medical field. Importantly too, like many of her colleagues at the Anna Regina School, she hopes that her academic pursuits would be enough to get her a scholarship. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Vishani Ragabir.